Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Several years ago, a group of random people made the bold decision to look for love behind a blue glowing wall. Since then, much has changed. Keep watching this video to find out more on Love is Blind Season 1 cast. Where are they now? Love is Blind or Love Binds? The cast initially came together a few years ago. They had no idea, however, that some people would discover the one throughout Love is Blind Season 1, in addition to a little drama amplified, heartbreaks, adventure, and even a few narrative twists. The participants in that initial experiment have matured since then, as they experience love in the real world, both as couples and as individuals. Who has thereby increased their level of exposure and vulnerability in their search for love? Who has completely given up? And how are the married couples who survive faring today? Lauren and Cameron Just recently, Lauren and Cameron marked their fourth wedding anniversary. The couple got engaged after experiencing an immediate spark in the pods, and they are now enjoying their happily ever after. Cameron just shared a photo on Instagram on Lauren's birthday along with the message, I'm grateful for you every day, rain or shine. You are the world's light. Amber and Barnett Barnett and Amber are still going strong. Amber and Matt have been enjoying their love and celebrating life together ever since they said I do. The best vibrations, not just a pleasant vibe, Amber said. Giannina and Love Giannina is traveling with a suitcase and is in love. The Bachelorette contestant Blake Hortzman and Giannina are currently dating. Giannina explains to Tutum, He's also from the reality TV industry, so we understand each other, and honestly want to do everything together. He certainly is the love of my life, I say. Giannina's experience on Love is Blind was difficult, especially after her then fiance Damien declined her proposal. She didn't want to put too much weight on herself when she was ready to start dating again after the show. It took me some time to reevaluate who I was and what I was seeking after Love is Blind. The program taught me so much about what I wanted in a committed, long-term relationship. But I made the decision to not put any pressure on myself, she says. She had never been happier than she is right now. Giannina explains that the happy couple's future plans are as follows. He asked me to move in last month, so Colorado, here I come. Love isn't in the cards for Kelly. Kelly is available for dating and is single. Since appearing on Love is Blind, when she came to the conclusion that she did not want to wed Kenny, Kelly has gone on dates, although she is not now attached. With all the knowledge she gained through her season, Kelly says to Tutum, I am actively wanting to pursue the dating scene even more as we move into 2023. She now feels that she has more mature perspective on dating and relationships and is prepared to find her partner. She has transformed, but how? Some people could even suggest that she's now even pickier, but she responds, I just know my worth and I'm attracted to the kind of guy who connects with me on a soul level. It's complicated for Carlton. Carlton wishes things weren't so difficult. Carlton has started to build walls around himself when it comes to dating, following an emotional breakup with Diamond on Love is Blind. Although he has dated since filming, he's not actively dating. When it comes to dating and letting down my guard, I'm a little more paranoid, he admits. Everyone has their own agenda, and I don't think it needs to be that complicated, the speaker said. Jessica is spoken for. Jessica has been married. In September 2022, Jessica and Benjamin McGrath got married. Following Jessica's turbulent relationship with her ex-boyfriend Mark, the two first connected in March 2020 and have been dating since then. I guarantee will be worth the wait, the detours, and all the locked doors. Going to be living this day again for a while. She wrote in her Instagram marriage announcement. She still cherishes the time she spent, even though she didn't find her true love on the show, she tells Tutum. It's amazing to see people finding love that way. At the time, it didn't work out for me, but in the end, it worked out in the best way possible. The Others Diamond continues to look for love. Diamond introduced us to Rumiel, her partner, who she met on a blind date after Love is Blind on After the Altar. Diamond is single and thriving, and the two have broken up their relationship. Two children were born to Mark. Mark found love outside of the Love is Blind experiment after being spurned at the altar on the program. In September 2022, he wed Aubrey Rainey, and the two have two kids together. Damien is a bachelor. The couple opted to keep dating for a while despite not saying I do to Giannina on the show, but ultimately broke up. When he accompanied Francesca Farrago to an After the Altar mixer, there were rumors that he was dating the Too Hot to Handle season 1 actress, but he insisted that they were simply friends. On Perfect Match, a brand new reality program that pairs Netflix's most eligible singles for an alternative dating experience, Damien is giving love another try. The actual world is where Kenny found love. Kenny left the show unmarried, but since then, he's found love in the traditional way. 
Though they appear to keep to themselves, he's married to Alexandra Garrison, and the two are unquestionably Instagram cute. With that, we come to the end of our video. The Love is Blind cast has seen quite the luck. Who was your favorite cast member out of these? Tell us in the comments section below. Keep watching until next time.